Good evening, everyone. I'm Jessica Dean. And I'm Yuki Washington. The overwhelming majority of Eagles fans who hit the streets celebrated responsibly. But for the few who did not, police have a message for them. David Spunt is at police headquarters tonight with the latest video that police want everyone to see. David. Some may think that authorities are moving on from what happened last week, but that is not the case. Actually, authorities want to get the message out there tonight. They have not forgotten about these vandals. They're angry, they're upset, and they hope to make many more arrests. A handful of vandals decided to repeatedly jump on a stranger's Corvette during the Eagles victory parade last Thursday. A few days before, a group caused chaos inside the Sunoco station on South Broad Street just after the Super Bowl win. Dozens ransacked the place and stole whatever they could. It is a big deal and we will find you. Philadelphia police detectives promised last week they would not forget those who climbed on this awning, flipped over a car and broke these windows outside Macy's. They're putting it in not only our, not just our face as police officers, but the city of Philadelphia. And the list goes on. Just today, authorities released new videos, including this woman pulling down part of a light pole. What she's actually saying is she's saying, I just took this. A man carrying this traffic sign also has the attention of police. Now tear the whole city apart. Now tear the whole city apart. Last week, Mayor Jim Kenney called the vandals knuckleheads. What I don't understand is how dumb people can really be. Uh, these days, everything's videotaped. And not only is it videotaped from security cameras, it's videotaped by themselves and their friends, and they post it on social media. So, I mean, you put your own wanted poster out on social media for all to see. And plenty did that just after the Super Bowl win. Authorities have yet to make an arrest in this Sunoco looting, and they have a message for this woman and this man who decided to vandalize, then steal public property. You looked at the camera when you bragged about the fact that you damaged equipment or damaged property. This would be a time for you to look at us and come on in. If you think you recognize any of these people, give Philadelphia police a call. Reporting live tonight at police headquarters, David Spunt, CBS3 Eyewitness News. David, thank you.